we wanted to do something really different. Uh, we wanted to do something that would last longer than just a day off normal training session might be. How do we really help our colleagues in the North East actually engage with what's happening, help their colleagues relate to the transformation. They approached us to run a five day programme around having how to have better conversations, how to look and deal with change. It's around not just having the technology but also allowing the store colleagues to have the right behaviours to, to bring this to life actually for customers and that they still have that great experience. I was already really looking forward to it, hoping that it was going to be me and it turns out it was. I was nervous but I was excited at the same time because I didn't know what to expect. So I think there's something about them experiencing it thing for themselves and then being able to then um, deliver it back in the store going, I've been through this and being able to do it authentically. The fact that you've been selected to go on this programme means that someone's seen some real potential within you and they really believe in you. When they first came Monday morning, it was very much uh, sitting there, rabbit in the headlights a little bit of what on earth are you going to get me doing this week? And on the first day we had a nominator who wanted to speak in front of everyone, there was like 90 people, and all I heard was, I'll do it! And I was like, oh my god, that was me. It's done in a way where it's not just looking at charts and just planograms and reading Every day has been like different. First day was quite intense, it was like technical. The tech guys were telling us about the headsets and how to, how to use them properly and what else was coming in. We looked at change, how change happens, what you can do to really um, help people through change and understand a bit about people's fear of change. We did actor scenarios, so we had actors come in. I loved it. It was like being back in store, because it's what you do in store. We looked at um, storytelling as a tool to engage people with some of the changes that are taking place within Argos. They've been getting on amazingly well and they have no problem in terms of engaging with people and um, sharing experiences, supporting each other, which shows me that we've got the right people here. It's very rare to have a group of 40 people who every single person is really engaged and wants to be there. And it has, it has a big mix of people. And really is that that created such a rich learning environment. You just learn so much and it's all about teamwork and working together. What I've seen this week with the team is that huge increase in their confidence um, and the belief in themselves. And actually if they stand tall, then they'll infect the colleagues around them and that we get that sort of shared passion that we've seen this week. It's draw things out of us that we didn't think were in there. <laughs> so my big hope is that the 40 people that have been here this week take that into their stores and they multiply that over and over and over again and, and we see that in all of the teams. That would be my massive, that would be fab. I was always kind of on board but I think even more now I'm seeing it kind of come into light more in place and I'm seeing everyone else being on board and so that kind of makes you aware that you are doing it now. It's the change that's been coming for a, for a while. The stories coming back down to, to, to head office are really it's a huge amount of excitement. You know, the team, the, the people we've got here are just exactly the right people. They've got the right skills, they've got the right approach and the right attitudes. It's been like so interesting. I would definitely oh, recommend it to, to everybody if they could do it. Definitely. Oh, it's definitely been I've fun. Doors <laughs> after and he's like, yay! Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I would really recommend anybody that was thinking about doing this programme from their areas to, to go forward and do it. They're really taking the ownership of this and they feel like they've got the skills and are ready to be able to take that challenge head on. So I've got it all planned, I've got everything planned for the night now. We're not doing it for another four weeks. They've got the whole company behind them. We're there, we're there for them all the way. And we think they're going to be the first of, of many of these team transformers across the country. Hello. Um. <laughs>